hello and welcome back to Thronebreaker. We are heading toward Rosberg. It's called the main quest, but it's actually Rosberg. And uh, we're probably gonna run into this uh, town for sure. Actually, that's gonna happen. And this is a huge map. We got a little art on the side as well. <laughs> what is going on here? Two hot women, and this guy is hell embarrassed about the situation. They seem so tiny. Whoa, 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 whoa. Really? We got this big dude there? <clears throat> I, I gotta have a... Well, I was just about to say that I should really critique this uh, map. But considering the kind of uh, uh, other maps I'm getting from uh, the villagers, I think we should just say, you know... Good job, because I don't want to encourage uh, something like the treasure maps we're As getting. As neared Gatberg, her eyes were drawn at once to the black pennants flying over its palisades. Nilfgaard's pennants. Her scouts found the city's buildings intact, its streets unstained by blood. Black-clad soldiers could be seen guarding storehouses holding loot pillaged from nearby settlements. Curiously, these soldiers were very few in number. What? Well, take the loot! Piece of... Price of peace? The gates stand open. Clearly the Imperials expect no attack, giving us the element of surprise. We can take back the city and... And make off with the gold. Gascon finished. Sounds good to me. <clears throat> no! Gatberg? What a, what a name for a town. Sure, we're gonna attack the city. Eve hated Nilfgaard and needed gold to maintain her arm. Yeah. Two very good reasons to attack Gatberg. Yeah. Her decision made, she ordered her men to prepare for battle. Now the invaders would have to try their hand at defending. Larvan! I say to nothing! What? Oh, fight! <clears throat> attack weaker units? Sure. Kill the little guy. Oh, short and battle. It's gotta be a, a special rule battle because those are awesome. <clears throat> Wait, what? Oh, yeah. Special rule. Wait, but this is my deck, right? Yeah. What? What? Do we have some kind of special win condition here, or do I just need to win it? <clears throat> okay, those are pretty good, but do we have a special win condition? Unknown. That's not good. I'm not sure about this modern bear, actually. Could be a death card. That's good. That's good. I'm not sure about this. Yeah, let's go with that. <clears throat> they feel at home here, the North Guardians. Let's show them they're wrong. Yeah. Get these suckers. What is that? Oh, I see. So that's why I need to kill weaklings. Because he's gonna spam. There's a time to reap, a time to sow. Boost on them. But I'm pretty good with uh, boost spamming it as well. Scrubbing <clears throat> duty again? Oh, gods. I. I don't really have a way to kill Order. nine power dudes. Wait, does he have. No. Well, that's kind of hard to uh, take out. To later. So I'm all up for killing dudes, but they, they have 10 points. Uh, no, 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 he can only use it once. So... Well, playing the Arbalest would be nice. So we can do something like Rivian Pikeman in the front. 
appears late again. Then an archer. <clears throat> then the I don't know drummer in the back. Wise choice. Oh, no. Yeah, that doesn't even tickle me, man. So Arbalest can deal nine damage. Give me a target. Right. Maybe randomly we kill the guy. Nope. But we can use the stray slinger to do it. Okay. Well, I guess the drummer can be played a little later. Although we would get at uh Uh, one of these. So, that would be preferable. Maybe we're just gonna... Drummer. Army's wasted time in the back. Me. Wait, what? Oh. Really? That's pretty big. You know, if I had this guy... I would put him in. It's unclear whose turn it is, but it's not mine, right? It should be that was more visual. Spawn a random potion in hand? Whoa! Okay. Drummer gets out. Get in the this back. Will be reaping black clad heads. Who's... Actually, I fucked up. I should have played Reynard Odo. And I still got her. Majesty knows what she's doing. And yeah, we lost well, seven points. Hmm. The likelihood that we kill two units is pretty low. But why does it take you like a year to decide? Okay, I guess the stray slinger is a decent choice. Have it the white of an eye from our fully uh, Okay. Might took some damage. It seems it yeah, current power, so we are kinda fine. I'm not a huge fan of Mardrum, I think we gotta kick it. So, let's boost the biggest guy. Hmm. I won't be able to play the power, uh, the hero power again. Because now I play a card, then I play a card, then I don't have a hero power, so we might as well do Lyrian Horn and do this right now. That's a lot of points, mate! So the game was all about, oh, this is the strategy, or just kill the little man. Or maybe, maybe that's gonna be relevant, but what I have right now is pretty good. And these uh, Riven the Pikemen have a good synergy with the Arbalest. And the horn, so... Although, they do make the mulligan a little bit trickier. Well, I really hope you got a guy that's worth 250 points. I mean, 150 points or something like that. Holy shit, this is like playing online Gwent. The opponent has one card and he's thinking about how to play it. Holy fuck! Quiet. This game really I'm prepares sorry. you for online Gwent. The battle's won, your majesty. Reynard, what the fuck? I don't get you. He, why did you say that? I obviously knew that. We were winning big time. It was, it was a done deal. And Reynard just come, uh, comes and like, says like, 
Ooh, by the way, we won. And I'm just giving him the weird look. What the fuck are you on about? Like, was that like some lame effort to take credit? Meave's victory, much to its inhabitants' displeasure. While she examined the Nilfgaardian storehouses, the city's mayor, an elderly gentleman with a walrus moustache, requested a private audience. Your Grace, I am old. Kill me, you'll merely save my gout the trouble. So I'll be frank. You put few men. You'll not spare a one to defend the city. When you ride off, the Imperials will retake Gatberg, peer into their looted storehouses, and seek revenge. You will be far off while well, we shall be oh so terribly near. The old man creaked down onto his knees and gripped the hem of the Queen's coat with knobby fingers. Your Majesty, I beg you, leave the gold, or the streets of Gatberg will flow with the blood of our women and children. What? Alright. Obviously this is a tricky situation, but the thing is... Hmm... First of all, old man. Uh, loving the moustache. Boris moustache. Uh, I really hope you didn't uh, trademark that one, because... Uh, that's uh, one glorious way uh, to have a mustache and just call it that. And you just can just like brag about it. But I'm maybe somewhat getting off track here. But I wanted to address the most important issue first. So anyway, uh, about not taking their stuff. I don't really believe in that because you guys can't defend it. Because that's kind of how it works. If you have stuff but you can't defend it, then you don't have stuff. So, you guys obviously don't have stuff. And I'm not sure... Well... well. Oh yeah, women and, and children. Uh, that's a good point. So I, I guess they took most of the men as slaves. But I think they're just gonna take most of the women as slaves as well. So, my point is... Me leaving you guys stuff would help Nilfgaard and wouldn't help you guys, most likely. So, you guys need to get the hell out, but I de definitely understand that, uh, uh, well, you guys are in a pickle, and me taking the gold will not help, but I also don't want to help Nilfgaard. So, if you guys can use this gold to help yourselves in any way, I would be kind of on board with that. I'm not sure how would you do it, like... I don't know, like you just escaped some other country or something like that. I, I think that might might work. Who knows? But uh, uh, I'm. This is just a long-winded way of me saying that. Hey, your gold is mine now. You know, you, come on. Who are you kidding here? Like, I'm I'm pretty gold crazy. Uh, my my eyes lit up the 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 moment I was told there is loot here, and I definitely came for the loot. Just saying. Meave contemplated what to make of the fellow. Should he be praised for his forethought and concern for his townsmen, or condemned for cowardice and insolence? Black Rayler, however, had no such doubts. Traitors all. Small wonder the town's untouched. Must have opened the gates wide for the southern scum. Now they want us to let them fill their pockets with plundered gold. Well... Really? I was under the impression that this gold belonged to the town. Leave gold in Gatberg. Well, um, um, this is such a hard. Oh, I'm not taking gold. You're taking the gold. Well, I'm not really sure if this guy is 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 fake. Like he's not really giving me the whole uh very selfish merchant vibe. Uh, for which I would be very happy to just murder him. Uh, just like greed. No, no, no. That's not the vibe he's giving off, but... I still have concerns and, you know, leaving this gold here. Well, I kind of got a little bit... Got to think about this. That this is bad for the town, obviously. But slavery and... is pretty bad for the town, too. And, and Nilfgaard is not going to be okay with this. A little bit think about this like, uh, like strategies in wartime war where... Uh, an invading army comes, and uh, and uh, the country decides to just abandon the village, uh, take away all the supplies, 
burn down everything, and the co then the army comes, and they are fucked. They because they rely on those supplies uh, to 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 help them, and that's kind of the new god strategy here. Because they come come here, they overtake the town. Uh, they will expect the townsfolk to provide food, uh, to pay taxes, and uh, that's it. And that's a sweet deal. That's a very sweet deal. And if you guys care about the country, then I guess, and not being slaves, then uh, I guess uh, you shouldn't be on board with that. So I'm taking the gold. I think that's the smart thing to do, but it might be a little bit heartless. But I think you guys just need to leave. And going to uh, a big town or city or whatnot, you, you just gotta go. Because, yeah, I don't, I don't see it. After a moment's hesitation, Meave had her soldiers load the stolen gold onto their wagons. As you pointed out, Mayor, my army is small, which is why I need gold to expand it. The Mayor said nothing. He bowed to the Queen, then hobbled off, leaning heavily on his cane, as if this short exchange had cost him years of life. Well, yeah. Only 300 gold? That's not a lot of gold. You know, I would have loved to have that information before, because 300 gold is like nothing for me. We are like, oh my god, don't take our gold. Oh my god, we're all gonna die. And then like, I'm, I'm, like, I'm like taking the gold and like, how much gold you got? Like 10 gold. And I'm like, holy shit. Well, how about I just give you some gold now? Look at this. Look at this. What the fuck, guys? So you guys have 360 gold in the big old treasury, but I I found 240 gold on, on in the trash. And I, I suspect we're gonna find more gold here. Yeah, I managed to find more gold in the trash in my 5 meter radius than you guys had in the treasury. Oh, you guys fuck up, okay? All about, oh, look at me, we need the gold. We haven't any reason to rejoice, friend. Black clads will be back. Just you wait and see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By the way, this is an okay looking town. That apparently really likes to... Uh, <laughs> well, they don't really care about gold. Oh, look at that! Oh, hey there. Uh, some ghost. <laughs> I don't think that's the appropriate way to call it. She doesn't like me. Oh. I wanna have friendly monsters in my 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 team. We could just replace all the boring people that we have. Okay, is this a normal fight? Okay. Not that. Yeah, wait, this is gonna be a standard battle. Holy fuck, those things exist? I don't know, the martyrdom bear should probably go away. What about the mulligans I have? I have the feeling that maybe we should just keep some mulligans. Oh. Bar guest. Ah, should have listened to me, old lady. Oh, look at that. Have we got a tin? Actually, I might be in trouble now. Well, not now, but in this game. Oh! Wait, is it random? Bar guests. So Abolista, your command. Just boost. This could be a good way. Yeah. He passed. Okay.
Oh yeah, I have limited amount of mulligans that are that I'm like, like limited to the entire game. Okay, uh, how about just do some slingers? Ah. Uh. So, we're gonna start by... I'm not sure how much I care about that, but... Well, I don't know how much we care about Gascon. Ultimately, I would like to have a, a, a long... Round 3. If you can have that. <laughs> the slingers are the worst. Really? Oh fuck, I managed to forget about using my ear power too. Thing about slings, they hide well. Oh actually I have to damage. What is this? Okay. Oh. Now we can just play this guy. And... I don't know, move the... the banner. So this made Gascom a little stronger. But I just... Play the slinger. I think is I'm really good in in longer rounds, so I think that's what we're gonna go for. Passes. I passed. Didn't gain a card, but it is okay. Yeah. What I would like to prioritize is just a bunch of Leary incitements. The thing is, Black Rayla will get one out. This gets one out. Yeah, I think we should go like this. And then we can replay them with Reynardo though. Actually, oh fuck. And maybe I sh Yeah, we can't get out the slinger. Maybe I should prioritize the slinger. And we can't get out the modern bear either. So I think maybe even fucked it up, but like this is gonna be okay. Bar guest. We'll see. Uh, let's just go with Lyrian Sightman right away. We'll be reaping black clad heads. It's gonna be a little tricky, because we need to get out the Lyrian Sightmans. Okay. Square unit is destroyed. So... Let's play the drummer. Again and again then we and again. do Delirium Sidemen. It's gonna be a bit tricky. I don't know how much he's really getting out of this. Oh crap. I was hoping for something. Army's wasted time uh, someone like me. Better. My spirit's willing and how but these damn boots are killing me. And I guess yeah, it would be nice to take some damage on the lowest guys. Hmm. Yeah, that's not a blitz unit. That's nice. There's a time to reap, a time to sow, and a time to die. Play a card from your deck. So it would be the best if we recharged Regiment Drummer's Charge, then Black Rayla can play a card from the deck. Which is gonna be the Stray Slinger. So we can just put down Black Rayla now. The Demavend! 
Uh, that looks good. The problem is that they have so much uh, power, so high power, that I don't really see how we can Discipline shall bring us just take him out. Yeah. I... So we don't have that option anymore. Uh, we can just go Black Rayla. And that's Ever the whole deck. Something like that. But of course... Two free cards. Oh no, no, no. We already did that. Okay, fine. Okay, let's boost this guy. And uh, I can end turn. Right? Ooh, Night Raid. That's a little tricky. So, we can go with Stray Slinger. Get hit. Oh, we can't realistically kill it, so... This is the only way to deal damage. Making Gascon pretty decent. I'm really looking for... Damage unit into a bear. Now we can just go Gascon. <laughs> then boost. Wait, you're serious? This is a good way to get some points. But Martyr and Bernie needs to go. I don't really see self taking damage. So we're gonna do that. Oh, I'm taking. So let's boost the biggest guy. Again. Uh, this is a good time to use the Lyrian Merlot. And at the very end, we're just gonna Lyrian Horn. Okay. Just completely ignore. By the way, this is the highest uh, uh, difficulty. We just completely ignore all the mechanics. Fuck that. Just get points. Easy. Did I win? Yep, we did. We did win. Oh, what do you have? What? Alright. Anyway, uh, I think this is gonna be it for now. I, I try to uh, make the episodes a bit more uh, manageable. Because it can be just overwhelming to watch a long episode. But I would like to hear what you guys think about that. So, thanks for watching and see you next time.